welcome to my YouTube channel. This is a request by Sally. Uh, Sally from Kitwe requested me to do a video on this. Only Sally is one of my subscribers. She's also in the in my WhatsApp group where I I receive requests and have discussions, mathematics discussions with uh, the people who are in there. All right, so. Uh, Sally on how to find or on how to work out this question the first thing you need to put into consideration is the determinant they have said the determinant is 4 so since the determinant is 4 and uh, for us to find the determinant of P let me write it here P which is uh, which looks like this this is our P or matrix P just copying we need to multiply the major diagon and uh, subtract the multiplication of minor diagon so this will be x minus 2 multiplied by 1 so we are multiplying x minus 2 multiplied by 1 minus the multiplication of minor diagon which is 2 times x which is equal to 4, the determinant. So this is the procedure we use when we want to find the determinant. We multiply this by this minus this by this. So we have something like this. So we can solve for x, whereby we group the like terms So these two will come here and uh, these will remain like this. So when we say x minus 2x, we have uh, a negative uh, x, which is equal to 7. So we want to remain with the x. We divide by negative 1 by negative 1. And uh, this negative and negative will cancel. So when we divide here, we have uh, negative 7. So x is equal to negative 7 whereby the original matrix of, of P will be where there is X, we put negative 7. So it will be negative 7 minus 2, which is equal to negative 9. And X will be equal to negative 7 here. Here we have 2 and 1 over here. So uh, the next thing will be to find the inverse. So how do we find the inverse of this stuff? So for the inverse, for the inverse, we just uh, use the formula. Uh, let's say P inverse will be equal to 1 over the determinant of P multiplied by the matrix, this matrix or the adjacent matrix. So what we're going to do here, for this matrix, we'll switch the major diagonal. 1 will come on top, and then negative 9 down here. For the minor diagonal, we'll just change the signs. We'll put negative, it's positive, put negative. It's negative here, we'll put it positive, we we'll change the signs. So here it will look like this. This negative. Because... The determinant is negative 7, so this is the negative I've put here. You multiply by this new matrix. And uh, we have something like this. So if you want, you can leave it like this, or you can finish it up. You make it look like this. Negative 1 over 7 by multiplying everything by this, by this, this, by this. And here we have negative 1, because 7 can go into 7. Here we have 2 over 7, the negative and negative will cancel. Here we have 9 over 7. So this can also be the answer. Thank you very much. Remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel so that you remain updated whenever I post something new.